Hey guys, yeah, another day, another nice day, and I'm out for a ride, and I just had to get some fuel, and what am I doing today? I'm just riding, just felt like taking a ride, and don't know where I'm going to go, don't know what I'm going to say, but, um, yeah, but let's take a ride. Yeah, so um, as I'm fueling up, you know, and I'm always, I got the camera with me, and I'm just not sure if I'm going to turn it on. I said, you know what, we need to turn it on because we need to say something. And so as I'm sitting there, I, I got, you know, I, I wish I could just, I, sh I need to sit down and plan my, my, um, my videos and what I'm going to talk about. But anyway, uh, so as I'm sitting there, I just replied, well, I replied hours ago, or maybe last night, I forget, to a young man that's buying a uh, GSA. Uh, I think he's out of Virginia, and he's kind of on the fence. Uh, the dealership's pretty cool because they let him um, take, the, uh, take the bike home for, I guess, a couple of days or, 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 or something like that. And uh, he really likes the bike. It's a really good deal. Uh, the people that don't ride, I guess his friends and family, uh, I don't think they want him to have the bike. And he's kind of asking my advice, and um, which is is uh, I appreciate that he asked my advice. That he feels that you know he can trust my advice. I'm really not that type of guy that give advice. Uh, I don't like to tell people oh, you shouldn't ride, you shouldn't do this, you should do that, and you know, don't do wheelies, don't go fast. I'm not that guy. I just I'm just not. I just don't do stuff like that. But so he's asking me about the bike, and he, what's a good deal? I think they're good deals that he's getting. It's a GSA, and. Um, I just told him do it. I said, you know, life is dangerous. He's a young man, and um, you know, when he was even younger, when he was 18, he said that. Um, well, this life's long. He said that he was. Uh, he put a. He had a 600 and went down on a on off ramp or something. But you know, just a stupid young kid. I said, we all do stupid things when we're kids. That's, there's nothing to be judged about that. But now he says, I want to take it seriously. I do have a wife and kids, and uh, but I'm going to classes. They take the courses, and I even want to do the BMW course in South Carolina. So he wants to do it all, and I just said, you know, he's doing it the right way. He's gonna, he's buying a cool bike. He's gonna love the. I know he likes the bike, and um, I just said, do it. I said, you know, people that don't ride, it's hard for them to. Um, wow, this freaking light was so freaking long. Um, it's hard for them to understand. Uh, wow, and that's short. It's already turned red already. Wow. Uh, yeah, and I'm gonna get around this guy because I can't take this. So I told him, go for it. You know just uh go for it and uh yeah it's dangerous and you know i'm sure you know he says it's a it's a fine it's a tough financial situation i mean a, a decision and yeah it definitely is a a tough situation when uh when you, the finance comes into it but the, the ds has a good resale value uh it's a sought after bike um so i don't i don't think he'd like lose lose a shirt or anything like that so this is a no-no like i shouldn't be doing this guys But I'm not sticking behind him. So yeah, so um, I just told him, what the hell, you know? I mean, I didn't say what the hell. I said, I think it's a good deal. I said, just go for it, enjoy yourself. He, he wants to enjoy life, and uh, I just I can't tell him, hey, don't 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 do it. It's dangerous and everything like that. Do it. Have a good time. You know, life is um, uh, short. Uh, enjoy yourself, and uh, it's it's uh, it's I don't know. That that's just my opinion anyway. So. You know, uh, and he's uh, he's appreciative that that that, I, that, I, that I'm talking to him and stuff like that. And like I said, I'm not a, a great guy to give advice. I'm not that I'm not that dude. And um, but from my experience, you need a little bit of enjoyment in life. I'm sure he works nine to five or his, you know his job or whatever it is, and you just you need that little bit of um, a getaway or whatever. It's for me, it's a feeling of freedom and. Uh, it's a it's a it's a mental health thing for me. It's just uh, it's just getting on a bike, just doing nothing today. I'm mean, I'm not going any place. I'm stuck in traffic. Not not a lot of traffic construction. I don't really care. You know, I'm on the bike, and it just um it just makes me feel good. And so, and I think everybody needs that. And whatever it is, whether you like going bowling or fishing or whatever you do, it's fine. You know, and uh, uh, he wants to get back into motorcycles. I'm all for it. So, you know, uh. I, like I said, I'm not the, like the guy to give the advice, but, um, but you know, I'm sure if you're watching this, but, um, yeah, 
go for it. I, I think I think you'll have a good time. You'll enjoy life. If it's a financial thing that you're worried about, that's that's a that's a definitely you got to really think about that deal. Uh, but if you can swing it, um, I think you're going to have a good time. It's a it's a phenomenal machine. Uh, you'll really enjoy it. It's um, I mean I'm sure you had it for a couple of days or whatever. How long you have? You'll probably have a you probably have a good uh, sense of uh, of uh, how much fun the bike is and how enjoyable it is to ride. Yeah, so I, I, I thought that was kind of interesting that, you know, I get these posts. You know, like I said, I, guys, I don't have a lot of um, um, uh, subscribers and stuff, but I do get a lot of comments, and I get a lot of a lot of good, good really. I mean, it's amazing, though. I guess if you have a really busy channel, you will get, the, uh, you know, a share of negative comments. I, I get very few. A couple of snarky ones that, that I'll be I'll snarky back, and which is fine. I laugh at them. I love them. I don't care if you're, you know, like one guy, I had a... Um, uh, a political uh, little political sticker in my garage that he didn't like and he goes well uh, I'm out of here well that's fine you're out of here good so because you don't agree with my politics you're out of here I, I wouldn't give a shit who, who what your politics were if you had something interesting to say whatever and I, I, I listen to it I don't give a crap who, who you vote for who you what, what you stand for don't bother me you know especially in this country that's what we you know we don't fight each other on it we just you know we disagree and then we move on anyway and then I had another guy who didn't like the way I talked and uh, and I told him I said um, I said uh, you know he was like I said yeah my English is not that good and I, I appreciate all your you know your uh, your criticism but I, I forget what I said but I, I was just a little bit uh, just a little bit snarky back at him so anyway and um, yeah so but I get a lot of positive stuff it's like it's like most of the stuff is like I feel like I'm hanging out with guys in the bar or just having a drink or hanging out someplace at a, a game or something like that or just just hanging out and um, that's what it feels like. It just feels like friends, and uh, they talk, and uh, it's pretty cool. I, I like it, you know. And um, so it's a, it's a good interaction, and maybe, you know. And I always tell you, ask why I do this, you know, why I make these videos. But I guess that's one of the reasons. That's a good reason because uh, I'm interested in your guys' comments. I, I also say this a lot. I'm gonna repeat myself a lot. Is that I try not to be it about me, but I guess it's impossible because the, I'm making the videos. That's why I like to ask questions because I, I want you guys more involved because I think it's I know me I'm boring I don't know you guys you guys know me a lot better than I know you guys and so if you understand what I mean so and you know as far as I'm concerned I'm boring you know this is the boring ride I don't do crazy stuff like I don't go to the right here and jump into this field and do crazy stuff on my bike I don't do wheelies I do my acceleration runs and I get stupid with that but I don't do a lot of them, and that's not my shtick, and, you know, I don't do that stuff, and I, that's how you get all the people watching you, but um, I like it to be about, you, to hear what you guys think, and what your experiences are, you don't know mu how much that I really like to read it, now, if I don't respond to a, a, a comment, or something that you guys have said, it's because I missed it, or sometimes, YouTube is really weird, sometimes YouTube won't even, like, it'll show in my notification, but if I go to the actual my video it won't be shown it won't show there so I don't know what's with that but I know that's a glitch that YouTube has maybe it's something you said and they don't want to put it on or whatever I don't know but um, yeah I like I like the interaction it, that, that means a lot to me that I can converse with you guys and hear about your experiences because I'm really in, interested in other people's experiences on the motorcycle it's uh, it's just fun it's just fun to see what other people especially around the world it's amazing how many people I get from Australia it's so cool it's just it's 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 all good and um, I'm just happy you guys are tagging along and watching me and then keep the comments coming I just I just love responding to them and um, and uh, and I, I like to hear your guys thoughts on things and how you ride and what's your favorite stuff and all that kind of stuff it's just it's pretty cool and to the young man that's uh, I don't know if you'll see, he'll see this video or not you know you, if you have it in your blood you want to do it you have to do it yeah I know it's dangerous and, and it, it, you know you have a family and stuff like that but it's it, it's it's like I said it's a mental mental uh, stimulation uh, mental health it does everything for me just riding like this forgetting like whatever issues you have in life I just hop on the bike and just ride I'm just I'm not in my car going to the store and doing mundane things I'm on my motorcycle and my senses are alive and I'm I'm I'm, uh, I'm alive it just makes me feel so good and um, I think I said this in the I think in the post and response is that when I'm looking out at the world I feel like I'm 30 years old until I start looking in then I realize I'm an old man but so what's nice about it is I don't get to have you know I'm riding my motorcycle I don't have any mirrors and uh, maybe that's why I don't show my face. Very rare. If you look at some videos, you'll see what I look like. 
but very rare I show my face. And it's not because I don't want you guys to see it. And I, I you know, this just popped into my head, guys. As always, always things pop in my head. It's not that I don't want to, uh, it's not that I don't want you guys to see my face, that I'm embarrassed. I'm just an average old man. But uh, I don't want to see it. I don't want to see what I look like because I, I just don't want to, maybe I'm in, I don't know what's the word, denial or whatever. It's not like denial. It's just, I just don't want to see it because I don't feel, I, I don't feel, oops, I'm going to go down this street. Oh, fuck, and I got this guy to deal with. Oh, I'll go around him. I don't feel like I look, you know? I don't know if, it's, if, 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 if that's uh, something to exp how to explain to you. I just don't feel like I look. When I look in the mirror, I see this old man. I said, Kenny, what the fuck happened to you? But it happens to all of us, right? But, but when I'm riding, I'm looking out at the world. I think I'm a 30-year-old young man having a ball. I'm just, I remember pulling up to a light when I was in Jersey. And this is a kind of cool story. I'll make it quick. I pull up to a light, sitting at there. There's a, there's, a, there's a young girl in a Jeep. She must have been in her mid-20s. And I'm on my Speedmaster, I think. And I got this helmet on, you know, so you can't see my face. She turns to look at me and winks at me. And I said, honey, if you only knew what was <laughs> underneath this helmet, you'd be pretty much embarrassed. So, but it was kind of cool, you know, it's flattering, you know, you're, you're an old guy and some, some chick just gives you a wink and uh, a nod. And it was just very cool. It, is, it stroked the ego. It was a very, it definitely strokes your ego and it was uh, extremely cool. Um, where am I going today? I don't know. I'm just going to ride some, try to find some different roads to ride on. It's amazing that I've been down here almost two years and I still find different roads, which is kind of cool. They're not breathtaking roads like, you know, what you're used to guys, some guys from out west and stuff like that. Oh, here's two bikers. They're just kind of cruising. This is nice. <laughs> yeah, that's what I want to see. I love that. See, guys, and you know, they, they wave, which is nice. You don't have to wave, but it's nice when you do it. Like, I, I don't know if I, I'll have this on video, but you know, this guy on a gold wing, whatever he was on, he could care less waving to me, you know, but that's fine. I, I'm not upset like that. But when a guy waves back, those guys were just eager to wave. They're having a good time. And uh, it just makes me feel good. I would just love to hang out with him and talk to him for a while and then just be on my way. So uh, I know it's corny guys, you know, some of the stuff. It doesn't take much to make me happy, you know. Um, it, it doesn't really. It, it's just th these little things when I see people um, just riding, having a good time. And... Uh, uh, yeah, and um, it just it just makes me feel good, and um, it would be it's cool. Well, I've been going on on this one pretty pretty long on this video. Um, I, I got to chop it up a little bit. Anyway, I just wanted to uh, talk about that young man. Uh, I, I hope he goes with a bike. He's out of Virginia. You know, in the future, maybe I, I would love to ride with the guy. I would absolutely love to ride with him. If you're listening, we need to hook up sometime and we could ride together. I mean, I'm not that far. I'm in North Carolina. You're in Virginia. I don't know what part, but um, it would be that would be pretty cool. So and um, all right. So I guess that's it, guys. There's nothing special with the scenery and everything. It's just me BSing and I want to turn the camera on. And I just felt like talking today and turning the camera on. It's a beautiful day. The whole week is supposed to be beautiful. I'm sure I'll have more videos coming out. But I need to sit down. You guys need to help me to find what I need to talk about or what I need to do. What, do you, what would you guys like to see? Anyway, that's it for now, guys. Um, I'll be back. You know I'll be back. Later.